tack life from Porter Cable Sanders, side by side. As you can see, the tack life got a little bit of size of handage on the Porter Cable. Just the, the handle being the way it is. And this handle here can extend out, you know what I'm saying? It can be pulled out. Just twist this cap, and the handle could be pulled out at least another couple feet. Versus the Porter Cable, nah, that's it. I mean, I don't know if you can buy some extensions. I, I haven't heard anything about no extensions on the Porter Cable, but that's what it is right there. The only thing I don't like about this uh, attack life, as far as the handles go, is uh, this portion of the handle placement. No, this is nice and robust and, and thick, good padding here for, for grip. This here, not so much. And you know, different circumstances, you grab for different positioning on the, the sander. Or this, it feel like you're gonna get caught with tunnel soon, grabbing this. So I'm gonna uh, pad that baby out, build the padding out on that to extend the handle all the way down to here. You know, but other than that, the, the handles is good, nice and robust, good padding on it. You could get a good grip on that baby, you know. The porter cable handle it extends this whole arm. You could use this whole arm to, you know, get your grip on that porter cable and your positioning. You know, down here, nice and tight. Same thing here. But this part is too too thin, too skinny, you know, for any good grip. The other advantage this tack life has over the porter cable, in my opinion, is it could go up pretty much vertical stand on the vertical stand to get right up on them ceilings, right up on your flats, sand them babies out without digging out your work or busting your, your head cables. Boom, pow. Because the vacuum and the motor is on the head. No, everything is built right here on the head. That's why it's a little bit more weight to the head than the porter cable's head because of course there's no motor, no vacuum, assembly, no nothing, just uh, your head cord, which goes down to the motor that's on the handle. This baby, the motor's on the head, which gives it a little bit more weight, but it's not much at all. No, no not much at all. Then it provides you this nice LED light all the way around the head. You can see your work, no problem. Not on that porter cable. I mean, I love Sandy, don't get me wrong. Sandy's a beast, I love that machine. But the Tack Life and a, a few others have some advantages that the porter cable just don't have. You know, I like it, you know. I gotta get, uh, change the head on this baby. It gave up on me, but um, I'm gonna get it back running up in maybe a week or so. I haven't been in no rush since I've been, you know, using Attack Life. She just been giving me what I need for the moment. I'ma get it back up and run both. See the, uh, this is the switch for the light. Boom, bam, hit that on. Got the speed variations right here. Bam, bam. The trigger, with the trigger lock. You can lock the trigger if you want. And you got your sucking speed. <laughs> <laughs> right here on the head. You now you just move out for less, for more. I'm not really sure what this one is for. But I'm gonna leave it here, do a little bit more research on that, figure out what that one's for. It's not in the manual anywhere. Yeah, man. I like this tack life. I'm gonna try another one. I think it's called Viva, Viva Home or something like that. I'm gonna check that one out, see how it do. Great. Get my baby back up and running. A little speed variation for the porter cable. And you now you just got that your on and off switch right here. Boom, bye. And that's pretty much all there is to the porter cable. You got your, your head wire, head cord. And, um, that light, turn that light on. You're good to go. I like that this, uh, this pole can extend out. Another couple feet. You could use this with a vacuum or a standalone. It can stand alone and suck up dust. It doesn't suck up the dust as good as with a vacuum. <laughs> it comes with its own uh, vacuum bag. And uh, yeah, she, she does pretty good. 
But I'd use a vacuum with the FOU. You'll get the best out of it with a vacuum. It's, it's been cool, but peace. <laughs>